Hello, my name is Marina Leone. I'm with Monami Gabi. I'm going to give you a tip of the day by Scrapbook Expo. Today we're going to learn how to make crepe flour. All we do is we cut half an inch out of your whole roll and we'll be using two inch glue dots. All you do is peel it off, take the edge of your crepe paper and start pleating right on the edge of the glue dots. All you do is keep on pleating, you pleat, you press, pleat, press, as you go around all the way till you see no more glue dots. So as I'm pleating this around, you're gonna see how we're gonna curl the edges of the crepe paper. It looks really pretty. So all you do is keep on doing the same thing. You, the only time you cut the crepe paper, if you're gonna put another fiber in between. So let's say if you cut one pa crepe paper, you cut it out and put layer of burlap and then continue back again with the crepe paper. In this case, we're using all crepe paper. So as we turn, make sure every time you pleat and turn, pleat and turn, that's the key here. Okay, as you can see, we pleated, we see no more glue. We'll cut rest of them out. Don't throw this away because you could make a smaller piece flower and you take your little center. In this case, I'm using pearls. This goes in the center. You could leave your crepe paper flower like this or if you want to make it more fancier and shabby chic, we have this expensive tool called toothpick. You take the toothpick, grab a little, a little bit of the crepe and roll. This crepe paper is double sided so as you roll you could see the different color. Really pretty, so you do it all around the layers. Grab and roll. Skip a little, grab and roll. Skip a little, grab and roll. So you would be doing this to all the layers. It's really nice, so what you could do is you could use Luminart spray, you could spray it, you could ink it, all that fun stuff. Makes beautiful Mother's Day corsages, you could just peel it off, put it on a little card, or put, put felt um, fabric in between and use it as Mother's Day corsage so it doesn't ruin their outfit. So this would be it. As you layer them together, you have your beautiful crepe paper. All you do is peel it off and attach it to your project. Thank you for watching this tip of the day brought to you by Scrapbook Expo. Hey there, I'm Heidi Swap. Stay tuned for the latest and greatest from Summer CHA brought to you by Scrapbook Expo.